okay, well, well, maybe it is. Maybe it is flat. Hey guys, Andrew Richards here. I'm going to be talking shit on Fly Earth comments. So, let's see what we got. These guys are absolute idiots, and I love to just fucking joke on them and fucking cuss them out and troll these idiots. Let's get down to it. <laughs> so, you're an astrophotographer. No wonder you're pissed off with the people waking up to flat earth reality every day because idiots like you won't have a job anymore. <laughs> it's not my job. <laughs> it was nice watching you cry like your little bitch. Cry like a little bitch. Those are fighting words, motherfucker. Anyways, no, I do not work in the astrophotography field. I have a telescope that I take pictures through and that's just a hobby. It proves that the earth is not flat. The earth being flat or the idea of the earth being flat does not at all affect my job or my beliefs. Flat earthers themselves are projecting on me because when they found out, when they thought they found out the world was flat, it totally changed their mindset and how they see things. So now they're projecting it onto me. Come get me, bitch. The earth is flat and your audio sucks. The earth is flat and my audio sucks. So that's the argument. You, the earth is flat, therefore your audio sucks, or the audio sucks, therefore the earth is flat. You guys are not very articulate. Lamo. What else is that? LMAO, Earth is flat, dude. Oh, <laughs> Earth is flat, of course. You got me there, bro. You got me there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Earth is flat, because you said so. So that means the Earth is flat, because you laughed at me. You are a complete moron. Yes, Earth is flat and stationary. You are just a butthurt loser. You obviously have a miserable life. I'm glad all these flat earthers get under your skin. I hope you have a brain vessel rupture in that thick, stupid skull of your over this flat Ooh, earth truth. That's, that's pretty mean. That's pre I do have some health issues, but that's very mean. Read the first line again. I like that first line. You are a complete you. moron. I'm a moron, but they believe in the flat earth. But I'm the moron. I hope blood cell ruptures in your skull. They don't rupture in your skull. They rupture in the blood vessel. So they obviously don't understand biology or anatomy and physiology. I hope that flat earthers are all gathered up and sent to FEMA camps. So that's where they fucking belong. You guys are making me money. Ha ha, healthy Andrew. You look like unhealthy Andrew. Oh, whoa, oh! That video alone, I look healthy here. Look at my, my jawline. I'm very thin, lean, I got muscle. Yeah, I'm very unhealthy, yeah. You guys sitting in your basement with your all hunched over thinking the earth is flat and I'm the unhealthy one? Okay. Wake up, guys. Wake up, sheeple. I think I could eat alphabet soup and shit out a better response than some of these guys. Your, spelled Y-O-U-R. Y-O-U-R. You're dumb, stupid. You don't test it yourself. You only believe <laughs> NASA and science fiction. Laughing face, laughing face, laughing face, laughing face, laughing face. So I don't check it myself? What about the telescopes? What about my friend who works on satellites that I've looked into myself? I haven't, well you guys just follow YouTube and Eric Dubay, but I haven't checked it myself. Okay, I'm the one. Laughing face, laughing face, laughing face, okay. Where is he driving to, his safe space? safe space because you guys are challenging my worldview and I don't know what to do when the earth is flat I'm a I'm a globe worshiper shut the fuck up no I'm driving to a place called work keep doing that math guys keep doing that math shut period up period got me there you're Einstein's bitch thank you thank you very much lol math proves flat earth you need to get laid bro what makes you think I'm not getting laid Math proves flat Earth? Well, trigonometry is part of math and that does not prove flat Earth. You know that calculus actually exists to explain orbits and the function of circles and spheres? So you guys don't know anything about math. I doubt you've even graduated or gone beyond a seventh grade math level. You're not smarter than a fifth grader, I'm sorry. There is no telescope on Earth that can observe or take pictures of flags or anything Apollo related on the moon. The Hubble cannot even detect it. Stop lying. The argument from incredulity, I don't have this evidence, I don't know, so therefore you don't. Because they can't imagine anyone else being smarter than them. They can't imagine anyone in, in the world knowing more than them. Yes, there are satellites, there are telescopes, there are telescopes that can see things on the moon and see the moon itself. Yakubowski actually sent me a link from NASA that said, NASA guy said, you can't see the flags on the moon. He said, see, this is proof. You're using NASA. You don't even believe in NASA. And you're using NASA. Truth gets in the way of beliefs. It's flat, period. Truth gets in the way of belief. No, 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 no. Belief gets in the way of truth. You got that backwards. 
I think you're living with too many cats. The truth is true whether you believe it or not. Whether your cats whisper in your ear with your schizophrenia or not, the truth fears no investigation. You can look into this yourself. Patricia, stop being a bitch. It's official. You're spelled only spelled without an E. Mm -hmm. It's official. You're in love and obsessed with Nathan, huh? Dude, get a life. Stop thinking about him so much. He don't like you like that. Ha ja ha ja ja ha 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 ja. <laughs> he don't like me like that. I don't like him either. What makes you think I don't have a life? I have enough money to be able to do what I want to do in life. I make money and I hardly work more than four hours a day, and I'm able to make quite a bit of money that I can make these videos pretty comfortably. I have a life. Me hating flower does not mean I don't have a life. But since you guys don't do rational, I'll just say this. No, 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 you don't. Because that's the equivalent of what you guys are doing. You guys are like kids at the playground. Equal logic. The moon landings were fake. 9-11 was an inside job. I would listen to someone who had the critical thinking to know these things. I would not listen to someone who can't put pieces together to find this out. So you don't listen to people who challenge your worldview. You don't listen to people who go against your little echo chamber of beliefs. 9-11, you guys can find clips all over the place of people calling from the plane saying, Honey, I'm going to die. I'll, I'll see you later. Bye. You hear Betty Ong saying, Oh, the plane's been hijacked. They, I think they sprayed mace. We can't breathe. There's so much evidence. You guys can't say that either of those were fake. There's so much evidence against it that I don't trust your thinking for thinking that they are actually conspiracies. Why are you so interested in that dude? You have an unhealthy obsession, bromosexual. Please just jump out of the car, dude. So you want me to kill myself because I dislike Fly Earth a lot? No, I'm not obsessed with Nathan Thompson. I just really hate Fly Earth, and I hate that everyone is being deceived by this idiot. This world's knowledge is depleting very rapidly, and these people are responsible for it. Watch out, Nathan. I think this dope is on the search for crack. Ass crack, that is. And he's oh. sniffing out yours. This dude is way off course. Sounds like he's in a Prius. And what the hell is that wire thing he keeps grabbing onto? That's so outdated. LMFAO at this fool dot 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 exclamation mark. That wire thing is an earphone in my ear that I'm listening to as I talk into it. That's an earphone. Ha 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 ha. That's outdated. We still use earphones today, dude. You're using 400 years outdated thinking. You're illiterate, scientifically illiterate. You believe the earth is flat 400 years from when that was actually the common idea. So you are behind. Watch out, watch out, Nathan. This guy's gonna sniff out your crack. What do they think I'm gonna do? Go in and sniff his butt like a dog? What, what the fuck is this? Well, you are a dog. I guess so, dog. How many miles does a ball of dirt have to get to attract water to its core? <laughs> <laughs> How, he's asking, how big does a planet have to be to attract water to its surface? Enough for the gravitational pull to be significant enough where the mass is great enough where the gravitational pull pull everything inwards and the density will be thick enough at the bottom so that water can exist around the rock center. Um, we can see this with other planets that are made of you know liquid nitrogen, liquid metals on other planets. We know they exist. We have a thing called telescopes. I keep telling people that. Telescopes, guys. Satellites. Don't exist for fuck's sake. No critical thinking at all. Satellites don't exist. My fucking head. Where are you getting your information from, dude? I have a friend who works on satellites. He helps put them in the air and program them to get data. Where are you getting this information that they don't exist? You guys watch a video and you think you know everything. You watch Eric Dubé talking about satellites don't exist and you think that's proof. You don't know what you're talking about. You're literally making this stuff up yourself as you go along. You have no proof and you never have. Satellites do exist. Look outside at nighttime. You can see the light blinking across the sky. Go look for yourself, guys. Go on NASA's website. They have live satellites and you can see yourself. You guys are retarded. Do your own research. You're stupid. You can't see satellites. Wow. Everything you talked about is bullshit. You haven't done any research. Flat Earth is the fastest growing movement on the internet with over 18 million videos. I'm not even going to attempt to educate you because you don't even have the basic knowledge of the topic. All that I hear is that you've gotten the little information from a controlled opposition site. No one I know subscribed to Flat Earth because it's disinformation. Man, get your act together and the Earth is not a disc. Space doesn't exist for fuck's sake. What a very confident comment from someone who has absolutely no evidence. There's a thing called the Dunning-Kruger effect. The Dunning-Kruger effect is when your lack of knowledge, your lack of experience, actually works to make you that much more arrogant and confident about what you have to say. Space doesn't exist, says a guy who has no idea who has never been in space himself. You have no idea what I've seen. 
I've seen ODD TV's videos. I've seen Zetetic Astronomy's videos. I've seen Flat Earth Asshole. I've seen Patricia Steer, Rob Skiba, Mark Starr. I've seen all these people, and every single thing that comes out of my mouth is wrong. You said one thing right, though. I'll give you guys one right thing. You said Flat Earth is the fastest growing thing on the earth. You're right. It's the fastest growing virus. It's like a disease. It's like a cancer of the mind. It's the fastest growing cancer. So you guys are happy that it's a cancer. The bubonic plague was the fastest growing disease of its time in the 1700s in France. Flat Earth is a new bubonic plague. So yes, it is growing pretty fast, but that does not mean it's right. That's called ad populum, which means the idea that something is right because more people believe in it. No. Just because more people are deceived does not make it correct. Learn some philosophy and why don't you do some research? Healthy Andrew, you're not looking very healthy at all. Are you getting paid by NASA? LOL, they need a better what, what analyst. Healthy? They need, they need a better analyst. I wish they'd hire me as an analyst. Maybe I could have better money to do better analyses. I'm not hired by anyone. You guys are just saying that to distract from my comments. It's interesting that all the comments I get don't ever debate any of the points I make. The point that I have a friend who works for NASA, the point that I have a telescope that could see planets and flags on the moon. You guys don't debate that stuff. You just say you're wrong. Fly Earth is right. The Earth is flat and you leave. Sure is a great example of what's wrong with these flat earth people. They speak in such a way to make you feel like you don't understand exactly. what you're talking about Beautiful. more en enough to understand it. When in reality, Beautiful. they simply just don't understand enough science and physics, Beautiful. which by the way, is only a tiny amount of basic knowledge needed to understand the reality of the situation. Absolutely. And you're right, these people go down the wrong path consistently, and yep. now their delusions are the base of their knowledge. Yep. And when they try to explain actual science after they've already been brainwashed they can't possibly grasp the basic concepts of science exactly this guy is a very smart guy and i reach out to you brother who add me on facebook if you like and you're showing your ability to think critically rationally logically and examine what's around you to form a coherent opinion so i applaud you that's absolutely correct Flat earthers are so confident over something they know nothing about. And they're really predictable too. They watch the same circular reasoning videos and they get the information from the same people. And these people just grasp on strings, just anything they can get to make up their theories. They're really just grasping at air. And there's nothing behind these theories. They make you feel wrong. That's another reason why flat earth is growing so fast. Because like, huh, do you believe the earth is, is a globe? Look, NASA lies, bro. The earth is flat. Everything in front of NASA is fake. And the average person, when you're talking down, condescending someone like that, they're like, oh, okay, well, well maybe it is. Maybe it is flat. And then everything you bring up, like the curvature, the horizon, they'll just mock you. So yeah, flat earthers do spread their knowledge, spread their knowledge, spread their ignorant ideas through condescending ways and they make you feel wrong. They make you feel stupid. When in reality, they're the dumb ones. They are backwards in their thinking, right? They are, they're thinking that it's the tail that wags the dog. Dogs wag their tail, okay? It's not everything else is fake or the world's a globe because all this stuff that I showed, everything that we show proves the earth is a globe. We don't have to say, these are my reasons for believing in a globe. It's just everything points to a globe. You guys have to pick and choose, quote mine, take this quote, quick that thing to make your little fly earth argument. But it's just a delusion that you guys have tried to convince your mind into existing in the spaces between reason and thought. Thanks for watching guys. This has been Healthy Andrew. I uh, hope you guys can go and fuck yourself. Don't, don't be afraid to like, comment, subscribe, share my videos. And before you type anything, just go kill yourself. And make sure you download it before you guys actually watch my video. God forbid you actually learn something. All right, good night, guys. Go fuck yourselves. <laughs>